Hey everyone, today we go over the old gospel song called Gone Home. It's on page 8 of gospel book number 3. Bill Carlisle wrote this song back in 1955 and it's been recorded by Flats and Scruggs, Ricky Skaggs, and the Hee Haw Gospel Quartet, which is where I first heard it back in the day. Anyway, so let's get started. Okay, this is another song that's mainly played for someone's funeral or memorial service. Um, or maybe just a, a song of lamenting, of aging. <laughs> anyway, we, I play it in the key of G like the Hee Haw Quartet. However, if G is not your key, try a capo and find a key that allows you to sing how your vocal range allows it, of course. Uh, this is a waltz. It's in three-fourths time. And as for the tempo, that means there's three beats per measure. One, two, three, one, two, three. And you play it at the tempos that it's a toe tap in 130 beats per minute. So dun, 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 that kind of beat there. And the strum pattern is a down, 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 up. So, so you can count it like one, two, three, and one, two, three, and. That's the feel that it has, okay? You can vary around that depending on how you sing it. Okay, let's talk about the intro and the breaks and the endings. Uh, like the recording, we take the last two lines of the verse, which we'll work on for each section, like this. On the G, uh, C, G, I'm going to G. And then doing C with G in the bass, or you can do the rigor if you want to do it that way. Okay, this this is done on the intro and after each chorus and at the end to wrap this up. 
Now, if you want to play the melody along with it, you uh, what I do is uh, I stroke down on the D string, and then up on the G string, and then down on the B string, but I'm strumming down to it. Okay. Then I hit that, put the pinky down to make the G7. Okay. And that's, I put the pinky on the uh, third fret on the uh, fourth string. So. Uh, okay, so you just hit that G. And then you take your middle finger, and put it on the G string, second fret, press down, let go, play the B string again to go to the C. That's the B. Walking down that C chord. And then I go. What I'm doing is from the G. It's real quick walk up with the thumb on the F sharp to the D. Back to the G suggest you play the G like this. So to recap that, it's uh, you start on the G string, or on the D string, I mean. Okay? Now, if you're looking to add some performance flair, Hammer-ons and pull-offs feel real comfortable to add while changing chords and uh, and also while creating some nice inflections to keep it interesting. Hey, thank you for watching and hopefully subscribing if this is helpful to you. I hope you enjoyed Gone Home and, and don't forget to get book number three with the chords and lyrics for your iPad or phone and we'll see you next Sunday.